This crisis, this radio station, and a few other radio stations in the area will stay on the air around the clock, broadcasting emergency information. Here are the facts as we know them at this time. Apparently, slices of bread have animated and are attacking human beings. Yes, we realize how incredible this story sounds, but reports have been pouring in from all areas of the city and surrounding communities. We repeat, slices of bread have risen and are attacking humans. Civil defense authorities are urging people to stay at their houses and places of work. Keep your windows and doors closed. Destroy all slices of bread where you are. Do not open wrapped packages of bread. Simply throw them in the oven or the fireplace and burn them. Be careful about opening your refrigerator. The leftovers may have become dangerous. Again, we realize how absurd this report sounds, but it is absolutely essential that these precautions are followed. Your very lives are at stake. Stay tuned to your Don't radio or television for up-to-the-minute reports and updates. Again, this radio station... In you know, the basement's the safest place, and, and there's a television the down there. Let's put the, the women downstairs and go get my truck. All right. On the air until this Judy, comes take her end. downstairs. We're going for hell. We urge you to stay where you are. Take all precautions against the rampaging bread. Stay tuned and do as you are told. Although it is unknown at this time what started this crisis, Investigating scientific experts are betting on yesterday's explosion of the wondrous bread factory. During this crisis, Channel 27 News will be replacing all normally scheduled programming so that we can bring you the most current information as we receive it. We will be having live reports. We gotta keep those things back. Grab that toaster. take you to a live report from the field. This is Jeff Drexel reporting live from St. Kevin's Church in the downtown district. I'm standing here with Father Bry, whose church is being used as a shelter in this emergency. So how are things going here, Father Bry? Well, things are pretty chaotic right now, but we're doing everything we can to maintain a sense of normalcy. In fact, we're about to give communion. Communion? Doesn't that involve the use of the holy wafer, a form of bread? Well, yes, it does, but pardon me. 